But I mean, it's, I mean, the truck's pretty sturdy. I mean, it's it's a good truck. Right. here and today we are back in Fiveville in the America Freedom RP server if you are interested in joining because civ apps are open only for a limited amount of time because um, the director said they're only taking a certain amount and of course uh, they are taking um, police officer applications EMS and everything like that so make sure to get your app in link is in the description to the discord join there and you will be able to find applications and everything um, but anyways today well <laughs> The other day, the old Dirty Dan, Dirty Max, Dirty Max Dan, Dirty Dan Max, whatever you want to call it, backed into a lake. Well, it kind of did on its own. But anyways, so it, it went into the lake, and it's completely ruined, and it, it's going to have to be redone. It's probably got mold already sitting up in it. I basically just parked it right there. Still got my buddy's um, uh, flatbed and everything, but... Oh, old, old Jobs found out. Oh, Mr. J Bob Jobs, uh, fat stacks, little stacks now apparently, um, was like, "Hey, you know, what are you gonna do with that?" I said, "I don't know. Probably end up just like letting it sit. I don't know. I, I really don't want to work on it. It's just more headache thing." He's like, "Dude, he's like, I'll buy it from you." So he's actually gonna be on his way today to um, pick it up. I'm gonna sell the trailer and everything with it because he was like, "Hey, you know." Do you have a trailer or something? So, I am going to get rid of the trailer because it's not really my heavy haul trailer. It's just a stock one. So, I can always get none. So, we're going to have to end up back in the old second gen up. Getting a trailer. Taking it back there. And getting uh, uh, getting it on the trailer. So, so, when he comes here, all he has to do is uh, uh, you know, basically give me some cash. I give him a title and hook it up. I mean, the truck's pretty sturdy. I mean, it's it's a good truck. Right. I could... I could fix that. I, I can... I can fix... How did that... What the... I swear this... Dirty Dan is the curse of Dirty Dan. Pinhead Larry. Son of a... I could... I could... I'm, I don't I could fix that. I, I'm going to go hook up the trailer and back it up over here and apparently put the door back on. It's like, <laughs> it never fails with this truck. Like, how does that even happen? Oh, by the way, we're about to break down the uh, Yoda in the next couple days because it's getting close to December. That means snow. We don't want snow, but there goes all of our like lower vehicles for now. I mean... We can still drive it, but that truck is not going to see, um, you know, salt or anything like that. Let me go ahead and do this. All right. Looks like that's good. So, let's go ahead and uh, back it over there. I want to set the door up on there. I mean, apparently the bolts came loose. How does this happen? Like, it, it never fails. Nothing ever goes my way. I mean, I try to hustle with stuff, but I get hustled. My own stuff hustles me. I got to get that straighter. I'm going to bug me if it ain't straight. All right. Um, but these big toe mirrors, you think I could, like, literally back this thing all the way to Sandy and never look back? All right. You know what? I got a winch. I'll, I'll yank the front end around. I'm... One of those days. I gotta. How does this even happen? Piece of crap, I swear. I, Bob, Bob will never know about this. I will never tell him, he will never know. I've tied this thing down so far, it almost looks like the tires are going through the trailer. That old thing did not want to get up there, fell off the ramp once, might have scuffed one of the rims, but you know what? I'm not telling Bob. Bob should know never to buy something from me because I either dog it out, wreck it, 
or apparently it rolls into the ocean and the door falls off. Like, what kind of jank crap is going on here today? Well, at least the sun's coming out. Par apparently a, a pair of steering hose on blue too because the wheel just turned. Well, I'm going to leave it here. I mean, he can just hook it up. I'm not going to position any of my trucks ever again looking out <laughs> to the water because, well, it's on a trailer. Like, I'm just waiting for it to be like, sorry, Bob, your truck rolled out. All right, I'm going, to call, I'm going to text him and be like, hey, come get your truck before it, like, rolls away or gets into flames. Let's see. Hey, your ride is ready. Burns down. Perfect. I mean, I feel like that. I'll tell him I am at my house. I'm at my house. Bring food. Just kidding. Only if you want to. <laughs> He's going to be like, um, okay. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, we're going to wait till Bob gets here. I'm telling you, like, I... That truck would have been really good. I don't know what happened to it. Every now and then, just like me and Can-Ams, Can-Ams always break on me. And I don't know. Like, yeah, I mean, I just have, like, extremely bad luck. I'm just going to glance out here. It's like, when I bought this house, it's like, T TJ, you made it. You did good. And then my truck rolls into the water. <laughs> Good grief. Sounds like I hear him. I don't know if that's him or not. Is that him? I don't know if it is. I gotta... Is that going on? I know what's wrong with this car. The daggone alternator looks like it's floating. That, that seems like what's going on with it. I don't know. What the heck? What in the world? Piece of crap. Come on. Get that hose clamp on. Hey, Bob! Oh. Hey, stop staring at my ass. I know you are. <laughs> no, I'm not. Uh, I like your... What is that? A mask? What? It, you uh, know, what it, what's on it? What is that? Like a, a clown face or something? Skull, I think. But a I skull? got you your food. If you needed food. Oh, yeah, man. What'd you bring? I only brought, like, hamburgers because I guess that gas station only sells hamburgers. Yeah, I'll take some hamburgers, man. I'll tell you. I'm just kidding, but I mean, you know, if you, yeah. You know that mask on you? It, it, it's it's nice. I'm not saying it looks it makes it look like you have, like, a, a moose snout or anything like that, but... Man, you gave me nine Twizzlers. That's what I'm talking about. You good man. You know that? Yeah. All right, man. So you ready to come and look at this beauty right here? I tell you what, it's got a lot of work done to it. It's super clean. I mean, you basically could say it was washed inside and out. I mean, I have a cat that I have at my house that I'm going to pull the engine out of that. Yeah, it, it probably needs it. Let's come on out here. Let's Let's look at this baby. I tell you what, this truck's got basically a cleaning inside and out. It's got some really nice rims and tires. The back tires, I mean, they're basically like new. They ain't been burnt or anything like that. The guy took care of it. Um, the girlfriend took care of the guy, and they both took care of the truck. The truck's name's uh, Dirty Dan. Okay. <laughs> and uh, it's got new door hinge bolts. I made sure of that. You don't want your door to ever fall off. <laughs> yeah. Um, other than that, I mean, it's good. It, it just it rolled into the lake. I mean, you know that. Yeah. I mean, when I 
gonna I'm gonna need like to borrow some tools like even because I mean I don't have that much tools like to to pull out like engine. Like. Yeah, man, we can get you some tools and everything. I can bring my trailer down with some tools and stuff in. We'll get you a motor hoist and everything like that. I'm just going. We'll just. I'm going to throw this trailer in too because, um, it's not really my heavy hauler trailer. The rims on it trailer, I mean, they're they're expensive, but I'm gonna let this whole trailer go too, all right? I mean, would you be interested in like just like a body of a cat eye with no like motor or transmission in it? I mean, I've got two B projects maybe at a later time. Um, maybe talk to Tyler, cause you know Tyler, he loves some cat eyes and stuff. Yeah, he, but... he drives a couple of them, so yeah, definitely talk to Tyler or something like that. He might take them off your hands for a couple couple dollars. Okay, I got it. All right, man, so what was you thinking about what you want to give me for this? I was going to think about giving you like 5K. 5,000? Man, the rims alone on this trailer is worth 5,000. You're wanting to truck yeah. in the trailer. I mean, it doesn't drive. Like, it did drive. It ain't my fault it rolled into a lake. That I mean, shouldn't affect the price. For not putting like a, a stop, like some kind of block behind the back of the tire. Well, it ain't my fault. That go GMC making weak parking brakes and junk like that. I don't know what happens, but I tell you what. I paid 25000 for this truck because it was worth it. I'll let you have everything for ten grand. Okay. I can do ten grand. Ten grand. Okay, so and then I'm gonna have to tack on another two grand for the trailer, so it's gonna be twelve grand altogether. Okay, man. That's okay. <laughs> so, um, you want to pay me now? You want to wait? Cause I trust you. I know where you live. You pay me now, or we can wait. Whatever you want, man. Hey, with me, I can pay you now. Bring it on. I, it's all about the Benjamins. Now I want to let you know this truck might be cursed or something because I don't know why. It just it doesn't like me. Hopefully old Dirty Dan likes you. Well, I guess I have to go see an ATM, but I'll come back with your money, man. I'll just come by one day and pick it up. I ain't too worried about it. Like I said, I trust you and everything. You good, man. I mean, I can take it off your off your off out of your yard and then come back with the money but i'll just pick it up at a later time that way you can go check the truck out and everything i know when you get a new toy and stuff but um i'll just pick up the money at a later time you good man i i trust yeah. you and everything like we all friends here um if you want to go ahead and back your truck up i'll uh i'll get everything hooked up back here for you okay sucker bought it for 12 grand I only paid well. I kind of getting ripped though, cause I paid like eleven five. I'm letting this trailer go for basically five hundred. So I took a loss, but it's okay. That's twelve grand I got for a down payment for F four fifty. Any level, woo! I swear if they if they if it's sold, it will be ticked. That's a dilly. Yeah, come on back. Come on, come on. Slow, slow, slow. Slow. All right, might have to get over a little bit. Yeah, there you go. Come on back. Right there, hold it. Buddy, I, I think your ball size is different. Come back with the cat I maybe the cat I want has the correct size. <laughs> yeah, um... If you want to come back and get, let's see, uh, well, if you want to, you can take my second gen because it hooks up. Take my second gen and then just bring uh bring it back and get your truck because I gotta go inside and uh, like I gotta mail a couple things for uh, uh, Denise and everything. So if you How's want that uh, Toyota uh, mini truck? How's it running for you? Dude, it's good, man. We're going to have to hit the streets and drag some sparks because, dude, it's like November. In December, it snows. Like, it could snow in November. So, we've got to get our trucks out and hit the streets again, you know? It's kind of been a while since I had mine out, but 
Yeah, we gotta get out and hit them switches and stuff, man. <laughs> but yeah, if you want to take my truck, take it, and then just bring it back and get yours, that's fine. Okay, man. I'll appreciate that. Oh, no problem. I'm gonna go inside. I gotta mail stuff, a couple of things out for Denise. Um, keys are in it. Just take it easy. Alright, so I gotta go in here. Actually, um... I'll watch you back up to it. I'll I'll, I'll do that because I know sometimes it can be tricky backing up. Well, I sold the dirty Dan. I'm call if I get that green Ford. I'm gonna call it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Squidward. <laughs> Squidward. All right, yeah, you're good. Hey, y'all, let me clamp it. Don't go anywhere. I'm gonna clamp it. Or... I'll be back with your truck. All right, and it's locked. You're good to go. Be careful. Take it easy. Okay. You have a good day, sir. You said have a good day, sir. Make me sound old. Oh, second gen looks good. Just cruising up through there. Hopefully, you don't catch that uh, GMC wheel or anything going around. All right, well, I gotta go mail some stuff out real fast for Denise before she yells at me. She's uh, down in Los Santos with her mom down there, so I am going to go up here and mail that crap out. Then I'm gonna chill for the rest of the day. <laughs> All right, now where'd she put it? Oh, she's gonna kill me if I don't get it out in time. Yeah.